Hi everyone, welcome back to the vlogs. It has been such a long time since I've made a vlog. Oh my god, someone's walking by my life. Actually, I don't care. Just kidding, I do. Um, so I haven't been vlogging because I just- Yo, I'm editing right now. Why does the inside of my armpit look like a p- Move back to school and then move back home. So I tried to move back to school and I was like, I can't do this. I don't want to do this. I have things to do. And listen, I'm not talking down on school. I want my degree. That's like my number one priority right now. So I'm not saying like, screw school. You know what I mean? It's a privilege to go to college, but I don't want to live there. I don't like the city there and I just can't do it. And my schedule, I only have two classes a week or no, no, no. I have two days of classes a week. So all my classes are literally four in a row on Tuesday and Thursday and then I leave. So it's like I just drive in and out and that's my life So I'm trying to find someone to live in my old apartment. So if you're like in Columbia and want it hit me up <laughs> But anyway before this melts I got the pumpkin cream cold brew and I've never tried this It's new this year apparently and you know, I don't really like sugary Starbucks drinks for example I don't like the iced pumpkin spice latte. I think it's just like way too sweet So let's give this a try and by the way I got a freaking straw by instinct and I forgot that these are like the non-straw lids. That was good. Let's just try it. It tasted really good. By the way, this is what it looks like. Look at that. That's pretty. The top. Yo, this is so good. This is way more my style. Like, the iced pumpkin spice latte is vile. I'm sorry. It's just like straight sugar. It tastes like straight sugar. This is amazing. The only thing is I don't think this is vegan. So, that kind of sucks. But I'm not going to get it all the time. You guys know I like to make my own drinks. But this is pretty good if you're like in a hurry, I suppose. But I don't think it's vegan and that kind of bothers me. But it's not like they put milk in it, I don't think. I think just the pumpkin spice syrup is like made with milk, I think. I think the cold foam is made with milk. I don't know. It, I don't think it's a lot, but still. Wow, that's really f***ing good. I'm not gonna lie. It's better than I expected. I don't really like Starbucks drinks that much because they're pretty sugary. But this is amazing. If you guys don't like coffee taste or like drinks that taste like coffee, they just taste like good. <laughs> you might not like this, but I watched somebody try it on YouTube and they were like, I don't really like this because it tastes too much like coffee, like straight coffee. And I was like, does it really just taste like plain coffee? But honestly, it tastes pretty sweet and it's good. I really like this. I'm gonna become addicted to this and that's bad because like I want to be vegan, but hmm. And I love their new lids. It's so much more of an aesthetic. Like it just looks nice. You know what I mean? Wow, that's like crazy good. This is probably my new favorite drink. Um, But you guys know I already got the pumpkin spice latte. You guys know I love that drink. So it's like that is fine but when it's iced it's too much sugar and i know it's probably the same freaking recipe but still like it just tastes different when it's like hot but anyway let's catch up because i feel like we have to catch up and i feel like i'm in an awkward position i don't know how to sit by the way my boobs are freaking huge right now for reasons that you can probably guess and no i'm not pregnant <laughs> let's reflect so i'm going or i already started my senior year of why am i red why is it turning red anyway i started my first classes of senior year i really like them because i switched to marketing this summer for my major and i really like it because it's creative yet business oriented and everything i'm learning i'm applying to youtube and the crystals and just like my general business knowledge and i really like it so i finally feel like i picked the right major i kind of let other like opinions and plans steer me into other majors plus i didn't really know what i was doing but now i do so like I don't want to talk bad on school because I'm learning stuff that is helping my um, future. Like, it's not just, oh, give me my degree. I know I already just said that, but I mean, like, it's not just give me my degree and get me out. It's like, I want to finish, you know what I'm saying? But I'm going to do it. This is my life motto. I swear I say this all the time, but work smarter, not harder. For me, I didn't want to be in Colombia all the time and going back and forth, like living in two different places. 
it's so nice to just wake up grab my book bag and leave and be back like for bed <laughs> and dinner like that's amazing and all my stuff is at home and I haven't lived like fully at home since I was in high school I kind of did because I'd come home a lot but I never like all my stuff was always in Colombia and even like this fall I decorated my bedroom so cute at home for fall which I'm gonna have to show you guys when I get home it's so cozy and let me think I have other things to tell you guys this drink is f***ing amazing like I know at first I was like oh this is good like hee hee no this is f***ing good like please get it if you have any taste you're gonna like this so my room, I've been like kind of updating it and I want to show you guys like what I've been doing but I bought like a bunch of Philips Hue lights and I put them behind like my TV in my bedroom and I take snaps of this a lot at night when I'm gaming so if you want to follow my snap you can see like just the inside scoop because on Instagram I post more stuff for like everyone but I feel like my snap is kind of private still even though everyone can see it. I post more like private things on there. I just prefer Snapchat, honestly. But yeah, I post pictures of the lights and I set them up, they look amazing. I used to have like other LEDs, but not the Philips Hue lights. Those lights you can change to any color, any brightness, like they look amazing and I love them. So I set them like at night to kind of like a really warm yellow and it just looks so cozy honestly like it's amazing I moved the camera a little bit because I don't know if the vent is like loud I lowered it a little so hopefully it's not too loud but yeah so what else can I catch you up on I haven't been working out that much just because I've been trying to get settled if you guys didn't see my last video the Camarda crystals collection launched and this was for fall obviously and this has been my most successful launch ever and it's been like a week i'm not even kidding you guys love the collection it's like crazy because i'm really busy like this past week i've been making all your orders and just like doing stuff to promote the launch and like just stay organized and it is it's crazy like i really believe i'm gonna have to hire someone soon which is insane but i'm very selfish and i'm like if i can do it myself i'll do it myself but at some point like pretty soon i feel like i'm gonna have to hire someone because it's getting crazy but next year I want to have a desk and have all my stuff in a desk because right now I literally have a box with everything that I do for Camarda Crystals like a freaking plastic box yeah next year I want to have like a nice apartment with a desk and like a room to work and I can have an employee come over like maybe it'll be one of my friends and I'll just hire someone and be like listen I'll throw you this money help me make these crystals and like I can just see it it'll be like a little workstation in my editing I am ready you know what I'm saying I'm ready and you know what's crazy everything that I'm doing it's not like wow I'm making like so much more money now it's like wow I'm able to grow like I can do more and it's not just for me like I really want to grow even bigger and be able to like reach more people and help more people because guys as the company grows we're gonna be donating more and more money to these charities and like spreading the word of these charities and that's crazy because I'm just like I'm actually making like a significant not like crazy but I'm making a way bigger impact than I was and it's not just like I don't know it's not just like oh we're growing and I'm getting rich <laughs> I'm getting rich and helping you guys <laughs> shut up like shut the f up this is amazing this drink I already know I'm gonna f get it every day there it goes being vegan honestly I suck the cows are gonna come and like haunt me honestly I feel like I'm just now getting settled again which is why I'm vlogging like it has been crazy because I thought I was gonna be moving to Colombia, and then I was like getting everything ready to move there and then I was like no I'm not doing this you have to listen to your intuition because I was like no I'll live there and I'll just like make that like my little home I'd literally rather stay home here in Charlotte and like save money and annoyance <laughs> and just like ride out the year as easy as possible honestly I know that I'm like missing out on college but I don't care I'm already so busy it's not like I'm trying to like go to football games and go do like go to parties like that's not me that's never been me and like I don't care <laughs> I really just don't care I've been there three years now I feel like I got my college experience and now I'm just like give me my knowledge in my degree and get me out I have more things to show and tell you guys but I don't know like 
when I'll do that. Um, just like random stuff. I feel like I'm catching up with an old friend right now. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I just shipped so many orders for the crystal launch. Like I shipped everyone's orders from the first day. That's crazy because it used to be like last year if I launched something it would be like oh like yay one person ordered today like on the launch day and now it's like a bunch of people and I'm like how am I gonna finish this? I genuinely believe that the crystal website and YouTube videos can support my life and I'm not trying to be a YouTuber just talking about life here now. It really annoys me though when people are like oh you do YouTube like they kind of view it as like not a big deal or kind of like not really like a job or like it's not a lot of work and it really is and I feel like every freaking youtuber says this but it is no I'm not trying to be a youtuber my whole life but I love doing it and it builds a platform to like reach people and do more because real talk the money I make from YouTube helps me with growing my business which is like my passion like I want to do business I want to have more businesses and these businesses I want to use like everything that I do to help people as well and not just me at the same time be creative and all that like that's where I'm at so don't come to me like oh you do YouTube because it's not just hey here's a sponsored video because it's deeper than that and you'd have to really like dissect it maybe to see that that's what annoys me when people say stuff like oh you're kind of stupid or whatever because or I don't know like view us as like influencers because we are but there's more to it that maybe you guys don't see yet not saying you but like just people that make like ignorant comments so yeah but the real ones know what I'm trying to do out here and I just want to say the life decisions I've made this past month are making me very happy. I'm just doing very well and I see a lot of potential growth in uh, in the channel and everything that I'm doing. I was saying something else but I forgot. Oh yeah, I'm, so I'm not trying to be just a YouTuber, like that's just a little piece of the empire. <laughs> I'm just kidding, kinda. But anyway, back to YouTube. I asked you guys what you want to see me do because I honestly have no idea what to film and like I feel like my past videos from like this month because the schedule has stopped the summer schedule three times a week is over sorry <laughs> but now we need a new schedule and it's been kind of like all over the place so I want to make some videos of quality and have a schedule so I feel like I'm gonna do maybe like one main video a week and I want to bring back the vlogs not because I think the vlogs are really gonna grow this channel but you guys tell me like I asked you guys on Instagram what I should film and you all like not all of you but a lot of you said to do vlogs so I think you guys like the vlogs and I had someone be like oh who really cares about the vlogs like a friend of mine people care <laughs> and I just really feel like you guys like to hear about my life and like actually connect more than just here's my stupid unboxing so and then, you guys, a lot of you asked for a Sims video or like Minecraft or Club Penguin. And if you guys like don't follow me on Twitter, I've been meaning to do a Club Penguin party for 20,000 subscribers. I wanted all of us to log on there. I know Club Penguin died, but there's like a Club Penguin rewritten where it's basically Club Penguin again, but they remade it. We would all log on, go onto the same server, and have a party like together on Club Penguin and then I was gonna live stream it and I thought that would be so fun and that could be like a tradition like we could do that every time we hit a milestone and it's gonna be so fun when we hit like a hundred thousand and we have a party for that do you know how many people are gonna be on Club Penguin? sponsor me club banquet <laughs> no like that is gonna be so fun I'm postponing that so we can do it when I hit 50,000 we're gonna do it like I don't care we're going on club penguin so stay tuned for that I know I say I want to stream a lot but I never actually sit down and do it because whenever I have free time like I want to be left alone because I'm already busy with like everything else I'm doing but I do want to stream but I think it's gonna be like a once in a while type thing not like oh I'm gonna stream now. I think that's pretty much everything. I know this was kind of long, but I've been gone for a while and I feel like I haven't really like said much. Also, I haven't, have I even vlogged since the nail video blew up? Like what the f Where have I been? Yeah, the nail video, I can't believe I had a video hit a million views. Like that's f 
fucking crazy. And I want to say thank you to everyone that watched it, even if you're not like actually a fan of me. Hi, if you subscribed. That wasn't even like that good of a video, but the algorithm just favored me. But I just wanted to say thank you to everyone that watched that and subscribed and is growing the channel. And like, of course, I'm very, very grateful but this happened in july and when it happened it didn't really like set in even my parents were like isn't that crazy like you hit a million views on a video i was just like yeah i don't know why but it's not really settling in and it still hasn't like it just doesn't feel like a lot not that i'm not grateful but it just like it's so crazy that i can't process it but i do want to say thank you i will say though like that video blowing up made me crazy anxious <laughs> because I just hate having eyes on me, which is so stupid because I make YouTube videos, but I'm pretty shy and hate comments don't bother me in the way that they make me sad, but I don't think people are meant to hear like thousands of people's opinions on you. So I didn't really read comments after a while just because like naturally you want to defend yourself even on the smallest of comments and it's like just let them go <laughs> just let them comment like thank you for the adsense thank you for the attention but like that's it you know i don't know like i'm just not one to be like sitting on the computer like seeing what everyone's gonna say even if this channel gets big and people start making like guru gossip about me like you will not catch me on there like no that is so tough Sorry, my camera stopped recording, but I'm about to go because this is getting way too long. What the hell was I saying? I don't even know what I was saying now. Anyway, it's been crazy busy and I just need ideas on what you guys want to see because there's a lot of new people in here now and I don't know what you guys want to see from me. But I will leave you with this. The iPhone keynote is in like two days. You guys know I'm getting the new iPhone and this is the least excited I've been for a phone in a really long time time because I feel like it's gonna be exactly the same but I know you guys are gonna want to see the unboxing I can't not do an iPhone unboxing but it's crazy to think about how much the channel has grown since last year's iPhone unboxing when I wasn't even at 5,000 and now we're about to hit 40,000 subscribers like that's insane but obviously I have to do an iPhone unboxing that is like the core of this channel at this point I feel like that is like what ties everything together. But yeah, I don't know what the hell I'm talking about now. But I will be doing it. And yeah, just stay tuned. Because I feel like that's going to come in like probably two weeks. That unboxing. I'm so excited. Like I know that it's not going to be that different. But I'm so excited. And I think it's going to be fun to unbox a new phone. And hopefully you guys like it. I'm going to try to make it entertaining. Even if the phone absolutely sucks. But anyway, I'm going to go home now. I've been sitting here for like 30 minutes talking to myself so I might just post this video like just this clip of me talking in the car because I feel like we just had to reconnect and yeah like I don't want to vlog and be like here's me at Starbucks and like shopping like I want to actually talk to you guys so yeah I'll leave you with that oh my god this is way too freaking long but let me know how you guys are doing thank you for watching and supporting the channel and i'll see you guys next time because i think i'm gonna film a sims video tonight so you'll probably see that next okay bye <laughs> oh my god my camera's hot